Welcome back on a Monday night and here's a snowy site that many of us aren't quite ready for. But keep in mind the first flakes typically fall in Buffalo this week on October 24th, even sooner across the southern tier. But did you know there is actually a spot in southwestern Chautauqua County where the National Nexrad Doppler radar system doesn't fully reach. So the orange circles here show the coverage areas for the Cleveland and Buffalo radars. And you can see there's a gap in between them, including part of our region extending over toward Erie. But there's a private company called Climavision that is installing a weather radar system in Pleasantville, Pennsylvania to better capture data in that blind spot. It's covering the area there highlighted in blue. Now the radar is being installed on top of a local water tower there it should be up and running within a couple of months. Now when we talk about that blind spot that it will now cover, it's really just at lower altitudes closer to ground level where the Buffalo and Cleveland radars can't reach because of the curvature of the earth and how far away they are. The CEO of Climavision told me why this may be especially beneficial here in our part of the country. You're impacted by stratiform. Uh, winter precip all the time coming off of Lake Erie. And often that type of weather phenomenon is missed by the existing network. And we will be able to see that unlike bef ever before. Many of our radars are currently being used by weather forecast offices around the country to, to fill in and better analyze these low levels in tandem with NEXRA. Now, we don't know if or when the Buffalo National Weather Service might be able to access this new data from this new radar, but Chris told me that he believes it will happen one day thanks to a partnership between NOAA and the National Mesonet Program that includes the Climavision radars. We will keep you posted.